Could you imagine if this, hold on. Okay, I'm ha this is like what I'm saying is kind of a half meme, but it's also like true, right? Like if the, if the person who did this commit or request was Muslim, they're like, they're using, they're using Amazon to commit like a form of jihad against fucking, against fucking Jews on the fucking Amazon web servers, right? Like that's what's going on, right? Like he, there is a, there's a junior dev who's engaged in geo banning jihad against Israel. I want to know who, ma who made this request. I don't. I don't really get involved in like those type of dialogues on Twitter. I. I think. I think it's. It's too. Um. It's. It's too risky. Like. Like. Don't get me wrong. I'll get people push back on stuff on, on Twitter, or whatever. When it comes down to like, um. Israel path, whatever. People aren't willing to listen. People aren't. I don't think people want to sit down and actually read or anything. I think they just want to get mad. So like, if I if you type something that is not within the confines of the main narrative, I mean, you get crushed. It is, I'm not going to risk that for no reason. There's, there's no, it isn't thing to gain out of that. Hmm? I mean, just look at that, at that, at that, at that Frogan thing or whatever. Frogan? I don't, I don't know how to say her name. Where's the shit anyway? Is it, is it all deleted? Is it being fucking brigaded or whatever? Like, I was playing Dota today, and I was thinking in my head, how can I make a good comparison? How can I replace the two terms, okay, the, of, of, the, of the scale? And maybe we'll understand that that's just a bad precedent to set on how to do a tier list, right? Because it's obviously from good to bad, because that's what tier lists are for, right? Imagine if, if, if the top one was, like, being white and the, one, and the bottom was, like, being black somehow. Like... Or, or white and black, like um, eating potato salad or something like that, or some shit like that. I'm just saying, I mean, you get, don't say it's a false equivalency. It is, it is, a, it is a direct equivalency. I want you to think about it. Hold on, hold on. Let, let's think, hold on. Let, let's take this, um... Okay. Hold on. Gotten literally no, not... Okay, not this, not this, not this. Okay, okay, not that. Just forget it. Jesus Christ. Um... Give it a minute, give it a minute, give it a minute, hold on. Nah, I think it's like gonna give attention to shit like that. Nah, I don't survive with it. Hold on, hold on. I can't even find a fucking video. Initially. Guys, is it been all like brigaded? All like that bullshit tier list. Hold on. I want you to think about it. Bro, that shit has been raised off the internet. Um. Oh my god! Okay, okay. Whoa! Okay, that's, that's, that is, that is actually off the rails entirely. We are, we wanted to address concerns we've seen about whether we're permitting the Twitch account signups in some regions. When signing up for a Twitch account, you can select an account verification method, email or phone for added protection. Following the October 7 um, attacks, we temporarily disabled signups with email in Israel 
and Palestine that need to prevent uploads of a graphic material related to the attack and protect the safety of users. What? Okay, okay. I understand that this this could make sense, right? But at the same time, um. Well, one, uh, how is that not fixed? Okay, it's fixed now. Um, I, I, I just feel like in a world where you were to do some crazy shit like that, right? Well, I don't think people would be doing that on their main, main internet and shit like that. Like, like VPNs don't exist. It's not like... Uh, The first one, um, why was a similar policy not implemented for Ukraine uh, and or Russia? Hmm. Also, our concerns about whether the community guidelines apply to all content on our service. We continue to enforce our rules as easily as possible, and we're actively reviewing content and taking enforcement action as, as, as where needed. Well, that's just incorrect. That's just not true. Sorry. Well, I mean, that, 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 there's nothing true about that. Yeah, come on, brother. Um, I saw some unhinged clippers like, Oh, yeah, um, I hope soldiers get the PTSD, shit like that. Brother. What? Oh yeah, hold on. Chat, let me upload to myself um, on Discord. If I do, I took it on my phone. Chat, because I switched I'm not going on skits, okay? Because I was on my phone and I kept, even though I'm refreshing for new threads on, on Twitter, I go to homepage, right? Bro, can, I, can we just get it off the fucking, like, can I, we just get out get this shit off? Not interested. I said, I said, not interested, and it, 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 it went back up. Again! Hello? Out of and look, and it's always Elon Musk shit that appears. Like, brother, I swear to God, I get Elon Musk posts that are a day old on my second or third post every time I refresh. Every time. Now I'm getting, now I'm getting, forget. look, look. Look. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm going to go get, get some water. Brother, on my phone, on my laptop, on my PC, on, on my alt account, I swear to God, I, I, every time I refresh, I get Elon Musk on my top page. That's fucking busted. Brother, he biased the algorithm to favor himself. That's so weird.
Distress, thank you so much. I will never have any fucking pity for any fucking soldiers. U.S. military? Who fucking who? I hope you get pizza. Dude, I swear to God, maybe this is a coincidence. Every single clip I've in this room, she's eating food. Like, it's, it's got to be the food at some point. That's just, that's the problem. Like, I, I'm, not, I'm not making this up. I'm not making this up. You can look, and it's not even offensive either. You can literally look at her you top know? 10 clips. I swear to God, you can buy six, seven of those just eating food. I, I do, the ones I do, I, the ones I'm like whatever about, the U.S. soldiers, are the ones that like acknowledge that like what they did was wrong. They didn't know well back, they didn't know back then. Whatever. You're, you're a good person in my book. Oh my God, Tom, thank you so much for the 10 gifted. The, the, the U.S. military that are like, yeah, like, you know, I did this back then, but now I know it's wrong. Like, I'm changed. Like, fuck imperialism. Fuck this. You don't deserve the PTSD. So, like, so like, like, like somehow a pacifist, like, like soldier. So, like, supposed to have the military or whatever. You get all your shit. Get all your packages over. And then you supposed to, like, go out there and fucking, like, spread the love somehow. Like, shoot hearts at like people. Like, any other motherfucker, you're joining them. You're like, oh, my God, I want my fucking Camaro. No student loans. Fuck you. I hope you get PTSD. Mm. And I hope you get no health insurance when you get back into a fucking America. Gotcha. Mm. This is a fucking video to some fat fuck on YouTube named Boogie2988. Now, I'm tired of this fat fuck popping up in all my fucking search engines when I'm looking for a fucking workout video. I don't give a fuck about the aftermath from any of you boogie fans that feel sorry for this greasy fuck. You fat, fucking, disgusting, ass-smelling, blah, cheese-drinking, Crisco-bathing, lard-gargling, calorie-thieving, cabbage-patch-face-having, Dr. Robotnik looking, wing stop eating, McDonald's gorging, T-Rex arm having, non-vegetable eating, cook on a George Foreman grill just to drink out the drip tray, wide low, hungry, hungry hippo, planet, pretending to have a fucking thyroid problem, whale, slash free willy, parked bus, Yokozuna, flubber, <sighs> Kirby, salad dodger, chair crusher, Butterball, go to Subway but put everything on it. Michelin Man, happy because Hostess is back in business, motherfucker. I know there's gonna be a lot of people out there calling me a bully. Well, guess what? How I, is that I racist? I for fat fucking people, especially fat fucks who sit there all day, gorge and eat, and make money for doing. How's that racist? I have no pity at all for any fucking soldiers. Distress, thank you so much. I will never have any fucking pity for any fucking soldiers. So you see what you see what you see. It's it's a strong it's a strong take, and I don't agree with it to say that um to say that. But at the same time, that's still um within the confines of people will will, will say uh it's like whatever because no, nobody will say pity or whatever. But then then saying that you US wish military? battle somebody is is that's that's uh, that's that's all the Who fucking who? I hope you get PTSD. It's again toss, but nobody gives a fuck. Like, uh, I mean, in, 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 in the grand scheme of things, people on Twitch, like, they don't, they don't care. Oh, man. Anyway. There's no what Aslan Gold said. Terrorists are bad. Banned. 
Yeah, it was definitely, definitely stronger than that. The fuck? Dan's gonna come on Discord. Bro, I don't even have him on Discord. What? Dan who? Yes, what Dan? Dan. The cowboy Dan? Yeah, but what's his Twitch though? Well, what's his, what's his Instagram though? I don't get it. He's on Disney Discord. Uh, let me see. What does he want? Yo, then this guy's like always hidden somehow. He's got like shadow banned on my fucking shit. What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Hey, what's up, man? What's up? Hold on one second. Here, now right click. Now I've added you to a friend. Are you gonna deny me now? That would be way awkward. In the same room. Um, on this card? I got you, bro. All right, good. Um. Yeah, how much have you followed this thing? Wait, what thing? Fucking the last, like, three days of Twitch being insane. Bro, 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 you're a new frog, man. We've been here for years, man. Who the fuck are you calling? I was here before you were born. Bro, streaming. bro, bro, we've been, we've been in this position for years. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm talking about this specific situation, okay? This specific situation. Not, there, there's so many situations. Okay, let's just focus in, okay? How insane is it that Frogan is not banned? Okay, and I'm, I want to be clear. I'm not looking for people to get... I keep saying this, but I want to be clear on this. I'm not looking for anyone to get banned. I think it's like a shit thing to do. But if you're going to have the policies in place, you need to actually follow through on it across the board. That, you can't that, just pick that, and That's why I spent the entire night fucking staying awake debating on Twitter, brother. I, I mean, I know. I, it is what it is. I mean, what can you do? I mean, when when you have a son and, the, and that, that, that whole squadron, like... When these guys lead the reins and they do out of pocket, he, okay, let me tell you. I'll, I'll tell you how it is. That is, that is. That's the way it goes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drive for you. I'm gonna drive for you. Okay. Oh, okay. Let me pull up your stream then. Okay. When you have like the big guy, right? Like, like the big guy, right? And that person, like, let's say, let's say that this is the limit. Okay, the red is the limit. At which people will go on in behavior wise, paying me. When that person goes like all the way over here, uh -huh. that's that's the that's that is the, the the standard that you're setting, right? After that, all the smaller people, um, smaller individuals, smaller streamers, there, they can go near that line as much as they want to. They can be around that line, whatever they can do, whatever they can do, whatever, uh, whatever they want. Because if somebody was gonna get banned, it's always gonna be the the person that's that's the biggest, right? Because it's it, it's what gets the most motion, it's what uh, delivers a message more efficiently, it's what whatever, right? You understand know what that? Yeah, I think so. Yes. So, so being cost effective in terms of their moves or whatever, if Hassan does something like his whole like um, like terrorist shit or whatever, um, he sets the standard for acceptable behavior around these topics. And people, yeah, I 100% agree. He sets the tone of like, oh, this is now yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, So then people will go around it because they know um, if the person does that, and then whatever. Yep. And like the shit's, there's no, um, I feel like train wrecks. It's like, mm. there's complete double standards here. Like he unironically put on actual terrorist propaganda with uh, Nick and just left the fucking room. Yeah, well, I mean, so like, how do you, how do you how do you because there's I mean because there's possible deniability that if they were squeezed on this, I'm sure they would be like, well, I mean they would never I mean let's be honest they would never say any publicly about this right they're, they're not gonna have a debate or some sort of talk about that right but people would say, well, dude, terrorism is subjective based on who's doing it and who's receiving it, which I think well, is I... branded. I think there's an objective 
Uh, well, no, these yeah. are U.S. designated terrorist groups. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but that's, so, 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 yeah, but that's what I'm saying. That still that would still be within the confines of perspective based terrorism, right? Because in their perspective, this is happening, blah blah, and they can justify it in some some sort of uh, mental gymnastics, whatever, right? Um, so that's probably the angle that they would play, right? Oh, hold on, uh, real quick. The uh, the terrorist is live right now, by the way. I don't care. I'm not. I'm not gonna. Watch I, it. I know it's just so fucking stupid. He's on. You know, he got unbanned. After a 24-hour thing, the terrorist got unbanned, and he's streaming. I can't wait to watch the PUBG mobile stream. It's so fucking unbelievable. Oh my god! Like, I see. Here's the thing. Um, to you, you're like, oh, this is nothing new. Twitch has always been super inconsistent. So what I'm doing is I'm going insane. Okay. Right. I'm, com I'm coming directly at Dan Clancy, and I'm making sure that his name is directly associated with everything that's attached. So we have DanClancySucks.com, and on that site. I will make sure that Dan Clancy is forever known as the guy that has completely enabled anti-Semitism on Twitch more than fucking anyone else that there is. He is the anti-Semite in chief, number one, okay? And the things that I asked to have a conversation to get started with this guy are two things. One is I think that Frogan has to be banned to show that like you give any fuck whatsoever about inconsistency. If you don't do that, like, Okay, then there's nothing to talk about. And the second thing is Destiny needs to be unbanned. It's two years. You're going to leave Destiny banned, but you're going to fucking unban Fresh and Fit and Sneeko? Are you fucking retarded? Yeah, well, I mean, um, so s this isn't something new in human behavior, right? But this is something that I feel like you maybe you, you're not accustomed to hearing or maybe seeing or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. But um, I feel like when you... When you discuss these topics a lot, like like punishments for people, people's behavior and people be, people policing and shit like that, you're gonna notice a lot of what happens is that um, it gets personal really quickly, right? Yeah, and I know. there there are a billion avenues of defending something as it's not personal, or whatever, right? But it is, right? And unfortunately, what happens with people like Destiny, or whatever, is that Destiny is the type of person that will never give you any sort of like. Um, like escape out of that, whatever, right? He's gonna squeeze Twitch every time. Like, and then when you would get banned, I, don't, I don't remember this, okay? People, people, people love them to try to rewrite history about it. Like, as soon as he got unbanned, just to like prove a point, he like said it, like hard R, right? Did he uh, really? Yeah, I remember that. I mean, I'm not, bro, it was on ILSF the next day. Got unbanned, right? He's like, yeah, you can say this word if it's in a historical context, and he, he just ripped it off, right? As like a, as like a. That is, that is a very. I mean, but then. No, no, that a, but that, that's that not, a, that's not bannable, yeah. right? Yeah, exactly, right. But, it's but, yeah. right, but, you can understand it. The people that do the, the, the rulings, or whatever. I mean, these guys that probably, but that that shits on them, right? I'm not saying that that's a good thing, but they get buttered about this shit. No, I so, know that. Yeah. If, so, so, all the, all the stuff, all the bans, all the whatever, all the policing becomes. A lot more personal than just um, like objective, right? Um, I understand that probably the entire Twitch trust and safety team hates Steve. I would, I would almost they 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 don't, they, they don't like him at all. They they hate him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They probably they're probably not a fan of you either, but they can't do anything about you because you're too big. Is my my thing? Well, that's not true. I'm I, wait wait. My behavior is exemplary. The fuck? Okay. Um, what? I'm not getting. I'm not getting the fuck. You think that you're like, uh, they love you at Twitch? No, no, no. My behavior okay. has been exemplary. Or whatever you said okay. that word. Okay, I was just saying, I don't, I, what I said, I think, is that I don't think Twitch loves you. I just think that they... No, they don't like me, but, but it's another... Yeah, you're too, big, you're too I, big to fall. Yeah, but even then, even though that would be a shield, the, all the other shields, I've been really good. Okay. Well, you don't agree with that? I, I don't think I've had any, 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 any uh, controversy or drama. Or, and I, how long? It's been a while now, the fuck? Like, like how long you think? Three and a half years? Okay. Well, Steve hasn't had shit in two years, you know, because he hasn't been on Twitch. I understand, I understand. But every time that they look at him, right, he's saying some shit that, like, sounds like a disaster for them. Yeah, right? but you know what? Here's a problem. Hassan does the same thing. It's just that they, they like that politics, and that's the problem, right? Hassan, yeah, of course. Yeah. Let's look at the shit Hassan has said, like, recently in days right it's insane it is his chat unironically 
are terrorists in making, a lot of them. Like, if you, if I sent you the chat, you would shit yourself with I'm how not, I'm saying yeah, I said last time, but there's always some possible deniability of like, yeah, these people got banned retroactively, yeah, we don't. No, but they right. didn't. They didn't. I've gone through and checked. They're still in good standing. I know this. Because I've done this level of diligence to know how insane it is on Twitch right now uh, with the insane shit that's going on. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, but see, this, 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 this is different, a different ball game, right? Because they, 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 will, they will get out of those arguments like, like nothing. Who, who do you think I have to defeat to get my goals accomplished? I mean, what are your goals anyway? I don't get it. Is this some, uh, is my that, immediate is this goals a are, are, are two things. Yeah. Well, it, I mean, I'll put it this way. I'm not like religious at all. I don't give a fuck. But I'm just offended at this point at the incompetence. I'm actually more offended as a, a businessman than I am as a Jew. How incompetent and how fucking stupid are you that you fucking banned an entire country and forgot to turn the fucking white switch back on? Well, like talk about the bad publicity fucking yeah, spigot true. On. Even though I agree with that, I mean, that's like a point that's, for me that's, that's, that's more... That's like you, you fire your executive team. Well, I agree, but for me that's, that's one of those points that doesn't really hit that much with me. I don't know why, because um, spaghetti code, spaghetti coders will, will spaghetti code. It's not, that's whatever. I, oh, hold on. This isn't an issue of spaghetti code, okay? This is the spaghetti issue. code is all spaghetti code. It is what it is. Uh, this, this. Well, they can try to sell that, but it's incompetence because any other company, if you had all of a sudden you lost all of the users from one country, people in your QA department are going to be like, hey, uh, why do we not have users here anymore? People in your advertising are going to be like, hey, we can't sell any more ads yeah, but, to any Israeli companies. There's like no so, traffic so going on. So, what, what you're saying is that nobody said anything about this all the way through? For if I didn't say something yesterday, Twitch would still be banned in Israel tomorrow. So, sometimes like, Twitch will be banned in a country for like, for like one hour, and I'll have it's news of it. It's been a year. It. It's and been since October. You're saying that it's been a year since people have yeah. not been able to, to sign up Great. for a yes. year. Yep. If that's confirmed, yep. then that's that that, that is, is confirmed. A hundred percent confirmed. I mean that's that, that 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 that's completely off the rails because the they rails. must have had reports of that, right? And yep. decided they, not they, to. I act. have the reports. I have the reports X of people emailing in saying, "Hey, I would like to be on Twitch," and them saying, "Sorry, we're, at this time you're not allowed to have a Twitch account." Not, "Hey, uh, use the mobile authenticator," or "Hey, sorry, uh, this." Just fuck you. You're not allowed. I have the actual reports. They I mean, did this, I mean, dude. yeah, that's they fucking, banned uh, a fucking country. I mean, it's yeah. the only time they've ever done it. And their excuse also is fucking bullshit. Oh, what is the excuse? Their excuse is we did it because we didn't want any uh, like bad content to be broadcast on the site. Oh, can you... By the way, X, do you know of any other wars that are going on right now? Uh, yeah, there's a bunch right now that are going on. Going. There's, any, uh, any, there's, like, there's, there's Russia, ones? Ukraine. There's Yeah, I, those are ones I know as well. That's kind of weird. Russia and Ukraine never got banned. Hey, by the way, for everyone out there who's like uh, pro-Palestine in your chat, being like they don't want Israeli bots, guess what? They banned it. Palestine too. Cocksuckers. Fucking dumb shits. How do you feel that all your Palestinian brothers were disenfranchised oh. also? Yeah, they feel probably fucking stupid. What? You said what now? Every single... They banned all of Israel and all of Palestine. Wait, Palestine too? Yeah. Why? Why? Well, my reasoning of why is because, I'll say the same reason I gave before, is because there's not that many, because, look, let me give the most charitable thing to the people that are pro-Palestinian on the other side, because Israel has fucking relentlessly bombed the shit out of all Palestinians to the point where they have no functioning uh, communications grid whatsoever. They are literally oppressed uh, just constantly by Israel. So as a result, this ban really only affected Jews. So it's kind of like, the alt like it would be like if I said, hey, X, I'm gonna ban Canada, uh, and, uh, and Nunavut, and okay. Lease. yeah, and the Nunavuts, and you'd be like, well, one of those things really doesn't matter that much, you know, you're just kind of banning Canada and like throwing something in, yeah, there exactly, because nobody even has it in over there, but is exactly. it exactly, but is it that bad over there in Nunavut? Uh, no, in Tazan, they don't have internet at all, no, they have they have internet there. I was, I was saying that it obviously 
would vastly more Brother, affect um, the more. Yeah, but, the yeah, more... but I'm telling you, okay, even though I'm, chat is saying yes, you're saying yes, people are saying yes, I'm still a little bit skeptical. No, I mean, dude, their about, shit is fucked. Their shit is fucked, right? Uh, I'm still Gaza? skeptical yes. a little bit sure. about the fact that people were, uh, the, the country was banned for more than a year. I, I, but no, no, that's that's legit. I get posts on my Reddit when um, there's a promoter region within hours. The fact that this was only for a year. It was for a year, and I'm gonna explain to you why you didn't get as many posts. One, it's because Jews don't watch you because they don't like uh, French Canadians. The uh, fuck? This, the, the second reason is that it only affected brand new uh, Twitch accounts, not existing Twitch accounts. So if you were a uh, if you already had an account on Twitch registered, it wouldn't affect you. It would only be if you're a new user trying to create a new account. So basically, they blocked anyone from creating new Twitch accounts. That's what they did. Essentially, and in practice, they can try to like spill it like, oh, well, if you did this special maneuver and used your phone, you could do it. But when people would email into Twitch support, like, hey, I can't create an account, they didn't tell them how to do that. They just said, sorry, you're not allowed. Okay. Is, is it been in the screenshots of that? Like, uh, at least like a couple yes. of them? Listen that, that are That are dated from, yes. the, the, like, over the yes. year? Yes. We know the exact date that the ban went into place, which was October, I think, 13th or 17th, one or the other. It was, ironically, on the global day of Jihad. Do you remember that? Remember when, uh... I'm not... Like, I don't... Yeah, I, yeah. I'd rather not discuss things that I'm not, like, a master yeah, yeah, of. Yeah, I don't no, understand. No, no, it, Basically, there was, like, this big call to, that they are going to do a global day of Jihad, whatever it was. That was the day that they banned it. And then it's been banned since, until yesterday, or today. Or tomorrow morning, I guess, is probably when the ban will come out of effect. And people since then, uh, like, if you go to my Twitter, you'll see people that actually emailed into Twitch support asking about this. And their excuse throughout, of... Throughout the year. Yeah. Like, there was one in May, right? I have a ticket of a person in May emailing in. I think they're actually Palestinian. And uh, they said, uh, yeah, you're not allowed to have an account. They didn't say, go use a mobile authenticator. They said, sorry, no Palestinians. Well, that's fucking cooked. It's unbelievable, X. Do you know, do you know, do you know how fucked this is? This is something that has, like, never been done before. Is like beyond wild. Yeah, they banned all the Jews. Like you know what they, you know. What it could also be the work of one person though. Like, uh, in all defenders. I'm. I. Who the fuck knows, dude? They banned all. They're like, all right, listen, we have an anti-Semite problem. I got the solution. And they're like, what? What do you want to do? You want to like crack down on like the anti-Semites? Like, no, no. Let's bring back in Fresh and Fit and Sneeko. Let's just get rid of the Jews. That's what they did. <laughs> they're like, listen, we'll just get rid of the fucking Jews, and we got our problem solved for Gooch. That's it. It's like they're like, oh my god, like what a fucking yeah, yeah. But if they ban, if solved. they ban Palestine too, right? It's not really anti-Semite. It's just brain dead. See that? I told you though. How would you feel if I banned all of Canada, and then, fucking, Antarctica? You know what? Am, am, am you know I what? being? I'm, am not, I... I'm actually not gonna get agree with you on this. I, 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 I think that if if the target has collateral, right? I'm still going to 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 hold a dialogue with you that. The target is the main one, and and it's both. It's not just one. Okay, so again, me using the hypothet hypothetical, for instance, of if I banned Montreal and France and Antarctica, what would you what would you say that I'm doing? Well, I I know what you're trying to get at. I understand your point. I I don't think the comparison is a one to one. Defended X, come on. Well, I'm just telling you, it's not it's not one to one. Okay. It's not one to one. You're correct. Um, but I will say, have you looked at any uh, images of Gaza lately? It, I don't think there's a lot of Twitch streaming that's going on in that area. Personally, and that's you know that's not their fault. Okay, that's, that's I'm not saying that's a good thing or a bad thing. I'm just saying it as a fact. They have bombed the fuck out of Gaza. I don't okay. think there's a lot of Twitch streaming going on in Gaza. I don't think there's a lot of Twitch streaming going on in the fucking West Bank or the occupied territories, okay? It's pretty much, they wanted to target Israel, and they're like, you know what? Let's, uh, fuck it. Okay, well, I mean, I mean, uh, does his chat. They're saying that it's banned in Gaza as well, because they use the same yeah. internet. Yeah, well, I mean, that would be, I'm not, wait, did I say it's not banned in Gaza? I did. I said it's banned in Gaza and all Palestine, yeah. Because they use the same internet, so I don't, 
I, I think making an argument that it's targeted is it's it kind of falls. Um... It's definitely targeted. I, I mean, we've seen the code X. We've seen the actual. Yeah, code. yeah, but if it's both, it's not anti-judo. Okay. Um, their reasoning. No, let me take this back a step here. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Le right. let's replicate this one to one in a smaller scale over here uh, in Montreal. Montreal. We, we have Montreal. a massive uh, Jewish community, right? No, no, Montreal French people. Whatever. Um, there, 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 there's a massive uh, uh, um, Jewish like like, like like district um, of right? French Canadians. Yes. That are Jewish. Yes. Jewish French Canadians. Yes. Okay. Um, if I if I were to, to, to cut the fucking bell power lines, a uh, bell uh, uh, communication, right? Bink, and I cut it, right? And everybody's internet, all the uh -huh. of Montreal, all the English, all the all the French, everybody, and also, uh, so mostly Christians, let's be honest, or or, or whatever the fuck it is, um, and and Jewish would lose internet, right? Are we yeah. gonna say, oh my god, I cannot believe it? Bell is fucking anti-Semite because they cut off the power and internet to the Jewish people. Let me... Well, let I'm, me, let I'm me absolutely no, I, I I'm not going to yeah. say that. Okay. I, I would agree with you. You wouldn't say that. Okay. Let me tell you what I have on my side. I have a huge amount of anti-Semitic content that has been broadcast on Twitch over the last year that has gone unpunished from Hassan, from Frogan, from Denims, yeah. saying most unhinged so shit possible. So go at but those but one at a time. You have, okay. to, you have to isolate your cases, otherwise... It, uh, it, yeah, I know, but I'm, I'm trying to give you a broad spectrum so you understand what's going on here. Because Twitch trust and safety allows that to happen. There's a reason that when Hassan goes and does a terrorist music video and plays it uh, with no commentary at all, just does that, there's a reason he doesn't get banned. It's because the people in trust and safety are aligned with his political beliefs, which is, fuck Israel, okay? That's why. OK, so if you have all of trust and safety that is aligned with this belief that the Jews are bad and everything else, tell me how this makes sense, X. The only country that's been banned ever like this is Israel. OK, the reason that they gave for OK, it there has also been bans of other regions for other. Uh, there's other there's other countries and other. Um, sure. Give me one. Um, I don't I don't remember uh, Turkey at one point. No, no uh, that was Turkey blocking it, not Twitch. Oh. Everyone, I, I want everyone to know, by the way, everyone's saying, like, rip bozo, fuck Zionists. Guess what, dipshits? As I said before, Palestinians were affected as well. Okay? I don't know what to tell you guys. You guys are so brain dead. Okay. So completely so, like, so, uh, on I'm, one I'm, side. Okay, so, so I'll be on your side, but I have to be honest with you. On that particular point, I cannot establish that as anti-Semites. I don't, I don't think I can do that. Okay, well, what I'm trying to explain... So use all the other ones... It's a pattern. It's a pattern. That's how we determine... So, if okay, okay. Semitic. In order to establish a pattern, okay? Yeah. And I'm not some, some right-wing Andy or whatever, right? I'm actually yeah, dialogue... I'm, I'm dialoguating with you, okay? Okay. If you pick a target and it's a direct hit, 100%. Okay, yeah. And then what? And it, I think we should stay, stay on topics that are, like, guaranteed 100%, right? And not even sure. because otherwise, people will use the one that isn't that, right? And then it'll dismantle your because your case will lose credibility, right? Okay. What? What? So what? How would you like to start to talk about this? Well, well, I'm just saying I agree with you on all the other ones except so for that you, one. The, so if I were to stand and say, guys, yeah. here's my case, that's the thing I would say at the end, or I wouldn't say at all. I would say that all the other stuff that's more assured, right? Like the fact that um, there's clear favoritism when it comes down to um, what cultures are protected, which are not. Um, well, I mean, which sure. also extends not only to the protection, but also um, which ones that we can shit on. Okay. Which do I think, think is think a bigger problem. Yeah. Do you think that exists on Twitch? Oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I, Abs I know yeah, that, abs absolutely, I, absolutely, one hundred percent. Yeah. As I read your chat, I see people like saying like "fuck Zionists." And uh, if that was any other thing, except Eskimos. Yes, currently, currently in the the, the space right. of the internet right now is very you're you're pretty much allowed. Yeah, exactly. Um, right? To so say it's, it's anti, to be to be anti-Semite, uh, pretty much free, right? Yeah, without yeah, no, without I, much repercussions. That's just the yeah, way it yeah, goes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I understand. So you can you can like Eskimos and Zionists are like the two things that are allowed. So 
like the thing with Zionism, okay, uh, and this is what is the it's, a, it's you have to understand this is that it's become code just for the word Jews and people like to act like it's not. Let me tell you something. Ninety yeah, percent of okay, ninety percent of Jews are Zionists. Ninety. Okay. okay. So we're so le that... so let me let me ask you this. Um, if I was to say, um, what's a good example of something I can do here? You understand you can target someone as a race without targeting them specifically just by doing something that most of them have. Yes. Uh, whoa, whoa, yeah, slow down. Say that. Say that again. Say that again. I'm I'm trying to think of an example I can give to you. No, just say, just um, say it again. Maybe I'll catch it. I'll catch it. Okay, it's a dog whistle. Basically, calling someone a Zionist is just a dog whistle. It's another word for Jew. Like everyone who wants to say Jew, they know they can't do it because they might get fucked, right? So instead, they say Zionist. That's it. That's that's literally that's the joke. Uh, yeah, but there again, um, even even though I I do believe personally, that without even you guiding me, that that needs to be true or that is true. Um, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's a, it's a point of defense that they're going to, they're going to use and people are going to agree of with Of course, it. but that, but that's the plausible deniability. That's why it's so poggers that you can do it, right? You can be like, oh, fucking, you know, Zionist pig dog, right? And you can say it all you want. And it's like, cool. Like, it's the same thing that people do with Destiny, like calling him a Gusano and things like that. Because, well, because a, Hassan never got banned. If Hassan got banned once, they the wouldn't The same do it way that Frogan, uh, their tier yeah. list says likes the hummus, like the discount hummus or whatever the fuck, right? Yep. Right? Imagine if you did that with a stereotype, right? Including like, like fried chicken. Oh, yeah, is there a good example? Okay. I mean, this... using the word thugs. How do you feel about using that word? I think I I think it goes case by case. Okay. Do you want to say it? Do okay. You want to call people Okay. Of, okay, 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 okay. Thugs? If some okay, I use the word sometimes. Sometimes I'll say tug. Right, this guy's a tug. Okay, tug. so you're afraid to do it. So you understand. No, 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 no. I'm not. I'm not. I actually, it. actually no. say it. Yeah, it's, so this is a tug. This is a tug. This is gonna be a tug. You're a tug. Okay, so you won't say it. So you'll say tug, but you'll say Zionist. That's the problem. Okay. That's, well, no, no. that's it. You're that's it. no. Okay. Now, now you're just wrong. Now, you're, now you're missing Why a point. Am I wrong? Okay. When I use the word tug, right? Okay. It always hits the mark. Where there's, it's never up to interpretation of like, yo. Was that kind of racist? Was that kind of weird? No. I, I, when I use tug, chat knows for a fact. They know exactly. It's hitting the target. It is a one-to-one -one actual event of a tug. It's not what some... Is, what is, what, tell me what is a tug. Uh, it's, it's like a... Um, I know what the definition of a thug is. Right? Thug, a thug. thug. Is I don't like, like a... saying thug. I, I don't like it as thug. For, for, one, for one problem, it's a tug. Tug. Okay, so it's the same thing as thug. It's, it's, yes? it's, it's, it's like gang banger, robber, like... like yep. Kind of... Okay. Kinda, yeah, so I understand. But from, that makes sense. But there's a reason, and you can say there's like a cute, funny reason that you say tug. You say tug. I've because you seen don't movies. Say tug. I know they'll, they'll they'll be like, oh wow, that's a red light. Some guy pulls up with, with, uh, with a car. They hear rap music. Oh, what is what is this tug music? Uh, whatever the fuck, right? And that, that's what we're gonna do, right? I think that's bullshit. I don't. I don't I've never agreed with that. And that, that, that's stupid. And that, that's a that, that that's a dumb way to portray. That's a, just a stupid fucking thing to do, right? So I, don't, I, don't I, I always I don't make sure I never use it that way. Does that make sense? Sure. I. Let so me, let me play this way. If I said, um, so I don't dog whistle, right? Okay. So the people, the people, unfortunately, you cannot put a blanket on it and say, everybody that's saying it is all dog whistle. Yeah, I think you have to attack it case by case. Yeah, this guy's dog whistling. This guy's dog whistling. Yeah, then you have to go one by one. It's not like you can just put a fucking yo, and then they do that. It's that. But let me ask you this, okay? If I said that um, anyone in Utah who wore a white button-up shirt is skunk, who do you think that would target 90% of the time? Like, as an example, Mormons, right? Uh, so if, am I, if there's a word for that that's targeting those specific people, if you're targeting 90% of a specific group with a single word, like, to use a fucking more rough term here, not all African American people have nappy hair. Some of them do. Is it acceptable to call someone nappy haired, whatever? What do you think? That's not all black people. It's not racist. White people can have nappy hair too, as well. Correct or incorrect? Um, it's... You don't even want to fucking say because you're so scared. Why no, not just admit wait. that it's the case that Jews have fucking special case? Oh, wait, wait, wait. see wait. your chat going, oh my god, what? I can't believe he's saying it. Holy shit.
I'm that's not, the difference. Wait, wait, here. I'm not even reading the chat, bro. bro you're, you're fighting demons right now because I didn't even get into the topic because I don't even understand what you're saying. Here. The, okay. the thing, the thing about about nappy hair, if you if you use something it, with a negative mm -hmm. connotation, right? Like like a pig at, dog at, attached to a stereotype or or a, 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 a okay. generalization. Yep. Yeah, it's yep. it's bullshit. You shouldn't be doing yep. that. Like a pig dog Zionist, you think? Uh yeah. Don't like say a that. money grubbing pig dog Zionist. Uh, what do you what do you what do you think? Uh, yeah, well, don't say that ever. Yeah, I don't. Unless, I mean, unless that, unless that person is exactly no, that's that. A, that's a, that's okay to that's okay to do. That's the problem. That's the problem. Is that okay. what we were debating the whole time? Yeah, I've agreed with you that the current climate on the internet right now is that you can just shit on Jewish people, right? Yep. And, and and that's a that's good. That's good in their eyes because that means that you're like um, anti genocide or whatever. Okay. And if if people if if, if people don't agree. They're gonna say, "Oh, so you like genocide?" That's that's the current climate that we're in right now. I agree with you. We are, we are in a bad climate right now. And this rule by Twitch affected Palestinian people and Israeli people. Okay. Well, um, I mean, on Twitter as well. I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I'm seeing a lot of like fucking like like pro Hitler statements right now on on Twitter uh, main, which is <laughs> yeah, which is. Can fucking... you tell me, by the way, why did they unban Sneeko in Fresh and Fit? This is like something that, like, I'll have an answer for most things that come to like Twitch, uh, Twitch, like, like safety and moderation and shit like that and whatever. Um, that's something that I, think, I don't think anybody knows. I think it must have been like some, um, probably some people like reviewing old shit, right? When it comes to expiring bans, because they had they did something right of oh all long term bans will be appealed or some shit like that, right? You saw that they said it a while back. Remember that? Uh do you, I mean, they said that they would, yeah, they would have a new yes, look I, I, onto, on people that, that they put a band. They, they said that publicly, right? I'm I, sure some employees that, yeah. looked at the things that were like very old and kind of mundane, as in like ban reason. That's, that, that, that's my theory. So, my employee okay. went, went down, people that were permud in a certain timeline and are looking and are saying, this guy was banned permanently for, yep. for COVID misinformation. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm banned, right? They probably did that so for think, a bunch you think of that. You think the Twitch trust and safety is so They're so brain dead. It's just probably some guy at the office that just doesn't know what he's doing, or some guy that's like in favor of that guy. He's like, and eh, let's let's just do that, right? And who who really is gonna call him out? Because as a company, let's be honest. If that guy was fired, we would never know about it. The guy who did that, right? And on the other hand, on the other hand, if you really think about it, um, if they were to ban him right after that, it makes them look stupid. So kind of puts them in a situation where like, um, damn if you do, damn if you don't, right? We're like, they're not well, going mean, they, to, since I, they I'd already like unbanned them, wouldn't... might as well say, no, no, no. If they do nothing, yeah, we stand behind that, whatever, right? Until it's a problematic. That's what I think. What about the terrorist that's streaming on Twitch right now? Like I said, the, like I said, the, the, dude, the, the dude that hangs the, out with the hostages. The, the, the climate right now is that this, um, that's, I like your that chat now. That side your is chat, stronger. You're funny. Your chat is like you guys said, wait, Hassan? Hassan? <laughs> I, I like your chat now. It's fucking hilarious. No, not Hassan. The fucking Houthi pirate, guys. You guys are funny, though. Um, no, no, it's not like that. Like, uh, like that. That's just a classic thing of like, um, well, um, the current view is not like that so we can do whatever the fuck right does that make sense like it's it's uh, i don't think there's any excuse um the houthis are well, the, well the, there's, no ex there's no excuse but I'm, there's, I'm, no, there's no th th this is one yeah but you'll be that. alone though you, you know, not, a I'm lot of the alone. battles that you're going to be taking you'll be by yourself x i promise you i will get results you think i won't i'll bet you the fact okay? that you've been doing this for that long like like these couple days, days couple, and and you've gotten no traction is how what do you mean by it, no traction? I've gotten a fucking statement from Twitch. I uncovered that they banned all of Israel. I have House congressional members. I, that have I could with play me slots ADL on a non-banned website for six minutes and have them fucking ban the whole thing across the board. That's not, that's not what I'm saying. What? I'm saying I'm, I'm saying about public opinion. You like, understand that Twitch is going to be called in to testify in front of congressional hearing because of this. Okay. Wait, what? I, I don't know how I could be. Oh, you probably don't understand U.S. politics very much. Um, okay. The people that have reached out to me are members of the House of Representatives, as well as a senator. 
Oh man, oh man. Brother, brother, you are in a way over your head, man. Wait, why do you think I'm way in over my head? Um, I think they're putting a lot of emphasis, right, on something that if it doesn't happen, if it doesn't, they hold accountable. Nobody looks back and gives a fuck. These are battles that 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 you're that you're winning that that are one that are one sided in your favor logically whatever right that you're the whole wave. Nobody's behind you. Nobody's after you. When you're gone, you stop talking, yelling. Nobody nobody echoes your shit. These are these are these are battles. You're that wrong just... and you're fucking retarded. Oh, I'm because sorry to tell everyone, you. Everyone okay. that is fucking Jewish gives a shit about this. I don't know why you think no one cares. Okay, everyone in Destiny's community gives a shit. Everyone here cares about it uh anyone that's been literally suppressed by fucking twitch in their anti-jewish bullshit gives a fuck so not, I, I understand that it doesn't affect you having blonde hair and blue eyes but for the rest of it fucking matters I understand. yeah 90 yeah, percent of the world doesn't give a fuck okay jewish. okay 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 what i meant by that right is the big blocks that are the problem right you can everybody can understand something everybody can say something right that block if it doesn't get moved, it doesn't move. It's like saying, oh, dude, if you think about it, right? Your government- you see, I have been doing on. this for two days, and uh, I have- Hold on. Okay, Let me cut. I, I don't know what to tell you. If you were to ask, right? Oh, uh, the US population. Um, take take on uh, Israel doing this, whatever, right? Let's be honest. Most people are gonna say, yeah, don't do that. We don't agree with this. Do you agree with the government doing this? No. Nobody likes it, right? The government is, is, is funding this shit. Nobody likes it uh, uh, in public, right? But what changes or what moves? What, what actually happens? What is, what is, the, what is the, the, um, the extent of that outrage and that, that uh, the population doesn't agree with, with what the government is doing here? Nothing, nothing happens. Nobody, nobody gives a fuck. Like, like it, it doesn't actually move, right? Like, you understand that I'm not poor, right? You know I'm not like a fucking streamer that's working off three thousand dollars a month. I'm not retarded. I know what I'm doing. You know, I had, I've taken I know a company that. public before. Okay, well, I, can, well, I can do this. I'm a big boy. I know the right people to call. I'm not retarded. I understand public outrage. I understand how wait, to reach. This media has contacts. nothing to do with money. Tell you what, let's put a bet on it. This says you're that, so confident. This, I'm confident when, too. When did money kick into this shit? Well, you just seem to think that I'm not going to get any traction, and I know that I will. Yeah, but that has nothing to do with money. Okay. I mean, I would, I would, I would put money that I don't think Dan Clancy will still be the CEO. Um, Dan Clancy, there yeah. listen, 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 I thought the, I've talked to Dan Clancy a bunch of times off stream. I finally went at the, at the, at the club. He's a chill guy. He likes me. I don't, I don't mind him. I like him. He's chill, right? He's, he's a chill person, right? He's a fucking pervert. But okay, okay, hold on. You've seen his phone, right? It's nothing but like fucking 17 and 18 year old girls on Twitch in their fucking uh, booby streams. So I don't know what to tell you. Okay. And he has enabled Israel to be banned for a year. And he runs fucking interference okay. for Hassan. What I'm and saying, Frogan what I'm saying is that the current feel, right, at Twitch overall is that a lot of people don't like that he's going out on trips around the world and does whatever, right? That there's a big hostility in from what I've heard at Twitch that people don't like that, right? People are giving him flack for it, whatever, and people aren't happy. And yes, these things escalate. And yes, these people get fired. And it and let's be honest, as a CEO, let's be honest, they're just a face. They don't really do much of anything, right? I mean, look at the other guy, Emmett Shear. That guy was that guy. wrong. Twitch and safety reports directly to Dan Clancy. It's been set up specifically that way. Okay. Normally, there would be more layers of obfuscation, but in Twitch's case, that's not the case. So when the ban in Israel went into effect, it was directly at the behest of Twitch, uh, the trust and safety and him okay and when the rules come in where hey uh frogan got reported for this shit but you know she's kind of our rising star what do you want to do and they say oh let's just wait it out that's dan clancy okay dan clancy okay people. and 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 let's be let's be honest let's be honest let's be honest yeah go ahead the trade-off in terms of public appearances right if they ban her is a lot worse as a as a mega liberal company politically correct right than not banning her because when they don't ban her, all they get is Dan with his fucking hat, yelling on top of his fucking Twitch stream, right? Wrong. And then making a website. But if the they do ban her, they, do ban her right they say, oh, guys, you know, you isn't, wrong, isn't right? Twitch doing, doing genocide by banning somebody who's calling out genocide? Yuck. 
that trade-off is about, I would say, a 15 to 1 in terms of negative impact. So okay. for them, well, it's, a, for them it's a no-brainer. It's a no-brainer. You know it's like, a no-brainer. You know it's a no-brainer. What are you talking about? I mean, you have Donut Operator. You have Nick Merckx. You have, uh, like, everyone at the Daily Wire. Nick, like, do you think these Nick are... Merckx is shadow banned on half the, plat on half the platforms. I'm just saying you're acting like no one's going to give a shit. People give a shit. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Most people that are, that are talking shit are, are disenfranchised, okay? The, the, the people that... I, I'm, I'm not trying to disintegrate their credibility. I'm just, I'm just saying it. it's, it's not the strongest argument. It's, you're, you're, you're not... Like, you don't have much to, much to send on here. X, I love you, but you have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. You are so completely wrong, absolutely, I don't even know what to tell you. It's like you, you somehow have no I idea. I have They're done this before! I've done this before, like, this before, like, like ten okay. times. Like done what? What have you done ten times? Tried to get something done, and you think I can't because you couldn't? Brother, 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 brother. I had to get like like the entire planet riled up, okay, to fucking to make get Twitch to understand that not banning S fan for driving while texting or whatever the fuck you did, you did at the time, right? Was okay. was some bullshit. If I didn't nudge it, if I didn't do that, and it barely went through, and it, it went under the radar. You guys don't remember that? It's like that for the fucking for the for the gorilla ban, for the other bands, all the all the sexuality bands, the 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 the, the, the pool shit, the titty shit, the ass shit, the 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 ass and the camera. It's always and Twitter was on their dick and balls. And even then, when they were cornered about accountability and about consistency, you know what they did? We're making changes to the platform's um, TOS. Actually, we changed the fine print on these two paragraphs where these two letters are being changed. That's what they do. They'll evade any time that they get not to be caught in some, in, 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 in some lie or in some, or in some tangle that you're putting them in. Like, they can yeah, get no out shit. of what you're doing with the no. simplest change. You think that they're going to be, guys, we're stuck. Actually, we're wrong. They'll never do that. They'll do some, some bullshit loophole. And you're going to look stupid with your dick in your hand. Like, everybody, like, everybody always. I've been in like 10 times. Like, what are you on about? Okay. Just because you failed at this doesn't mean that I will. Okay. First off, banning illegal, or sorry, banning Israel is literally illegal in like 27 states. In any faction whatsoever. Okay. Say that again. You're, Banning anything having to do with Israel is illegal in 27 states. We have BDS laws, anti-BDS. I, I, uh, I, 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 I understand you don't know what this means. It's really fucked up law inside of the United States. It basically means you're not allowed to fuck with Israel at all. You cannot stop Israeli citizens, whatever, from... Uh, uh, oh, no. Is this some, like... Is this some, like... Some something that never enforced, never whatever. Is that something that like is historically has never been actually enforced or policed or or no, no. it's actively. Uh, let's let's be honest. It's like it's like saying it's like saying. Did you know? Did you know that that you are not allowed to walk to walk uh, uh, across the road when there's a red light? It is actively jaywalking. No, constantly. not the jaywalking. No. Exits constantly enforced. Okay, show me show like me walking. tangible recent examples of the high profile cases where that's been the case in the past. Of BDS laws. Yes. And then what well, how okay, sure. Go ahead. It, it's like saying that like in in some states, whatever, right? The anti gambling gambling's illegal no, is enforced. Like that that, that shit is enforced. never enforced. They don't give a fuck about that shit. Okay, where would you like to start? Okay, in Alaska on February 19th, 2024, uh, the governor, Mike, I mean, I'm just starting on A, on Alaska. Do you want to go to the Wikipedia page yourself? Because it's fucking 60 pages link long. Link it, link it, link it, link it, link it. God fucking Christ, you piss me off. I, I, don't, I don't mind losing on it on this point because it's, it's, it's such a small part of the dialogue. If I lose on it, that's no problem. You are not allowed to do the, you're mad, I win. No, you're mad and I won. That's okay. I, 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 like I said, I don't, I don't mind losing about this. Take a look. Um, where are the, the actual cases? That it's, it's evident? You're scrolling through them rapidly as to not see them. Those well, the that's, that's not true. Where, 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 where? Okay, scroll down and don't rapidly scroll through the part that has the cases. That's where they are. You can start with Alaska.
Okay. Um... And then you can go to Alabama and then to Arizona. And these are all the laws. And then you can see that there's enforcement there. And then there'll be some of them. There's probably other articles, entire cases that have been brought against people for doing this. Okay. Okay. So there was a big rise of that in 2016 that I see, right? On multiple states, right? You want to keep going or just can we move on to the next point? I don't, I don't, do okay, you yeah, think yeah. you're going to win on this one? After 2016, there's, a, there's I think, after 2018, there's I think one there's one case. There's one in 2024. There's one. There's one. There's, there's, one. The there's one. There's one. There's one case. Bro, are you, are you capping with me right now? It's genuinely because people typically try not to fucking ban Israel so they don't get the massive amount of bad press and fines that come with it. It's not like smoking weed and you're like, bro, there's only 15 cases. Um, it's designed to discourage boycotts of Israel. Understood. Okay. Understood. Understood. So, like I said... I genuinely think, okay, I, this is a hill I'm willing to die on, okay? That even though this has been enforced, right? All right, it, we're moving the goalposts, Twitch, but okay. Okay, no, no, no. Twitch, no, 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 because that's not the main argument. The main argument is, even in a world, right, where that would be the case, Twitch has so many ways of slippering out of this shit like it's nothing. It is insane. They have a bunch of, uh, they have a bunch of like, good faith things as, like, it's slid under the radar. We didn't Can I tell see you it. What I'm doing? it maybe, no, 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 no. Maybe you'll respect what I'm doing. It is. It is what Twitch okay, does I, I with DMCA. Yes, I I they have I good understand. faith I tokens I and I shit. I understand. I agree. I agree. I understand. Let me tell you what I'm doing, and I'll tell you why it matters. I'm not going after Twitch. I'm going after Dan Clancy. Um. That's why there's DanClancySucks.com. Okay. I will personally target the individual people responsible for disenfranchising Semitic people, Palestinians and Jews, for the last year, as well as promoting terrorism on the site. I will target them specifically. I don't need to go after So what them. you're saying is that is the equivalent of saying racism bad, low W. Saying what? Ra racism bad, low W. Yeah, racism is bad. I'm not going after Twitch. I mean, to a certain extent, they're like going after advertisers, uh, you know, because it's just a, another way to put pressure. But in general, I'm going after Dan Clancy. I want to make sure that when you Google Dan Clancy, every result on the first play page is him being an anti-Semite and talking about the actions that he did personally that disenfranchised Jews. That's how I get changed on the easy way, because everyone gives a shit about their fucking brand, especially executives. And when this motherfucker knows that he's lost control over his brand, and the only way to fucking take it back is to stop having fresh and fit and fucking sneak up. Hold on, on hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Twitch, Twitch literally runs. They, they run their shit. It is the most libtard company out there. Yep. They, their main currency, okay, is, is PR and acceptance and openness and all that bullshit, right? And, yep. and you think that uh, uh, you're against the grain, your uphill uh, battle in terms of public appearances uh, 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 thing, right, is what's going to make them change and make them do all that. Nope. I'm going to make Dan Clancy change. Okay. I don't have to make all of Twitch change. I just need to make one man change. Okay. That's it. And also, you know, if Dan Clancy is not willing to do it himself, specific people inside of Trust and Safety, there are people there, personally, employees of Twitch, who have names, who are I have not named yet, but are personally responsible for more disenfranchised, uh, for, for allowing terrorist content to exist. Those are the people that I go after. I do not need to go after the company. I will go after the people. Okay? I'm retarded. I will not stop. Okay? You have shit to do. I don't have shit to do. The, the, there's a higher chance of you being banned on Twitch for saying what you just said, right? I don't give a shit. I then then any of what you said going through. I'm just... I'm just I've if, streamed if, once if, in the last year. Bro. I'm just saying, if, like I wanna, if I want to pull the market right now, right? And I were to make a bet, right? On what's more you likely, you being banned for what you said... Right? Uh, but, yeah, or but or are you achieving what means nothing? I would I would I would I, I, I It doesn't have to be it doesn't have to be either or. How about me having an effect? I mean you can mark that whatever you want. We can put some money on it. I got some money to spend. Okay. Well you know what I would like? I would like a uh, mid eighties Nissan three hundred ZX. It's about ten to twenty K. My wife won't let me get it though. Even though it's not that much money, I really kinda want one, the anniversary edition. The eighty four. Um what is it called? Uh three hundred ZX, nineteen eighty four. It's like an eighties car. Digital Dash, the whole thing. Hey, boy, boy, what is it called, though? A Nissan 300ZX. 
anniversary edition. Okay, that's what I want. Now, what do you want? Okay, it's not an expensive card. It's ten or twenty k. We're talking about here. Oh I'm yeah, so I, I, oh, I like that card. That's a classic. Yeah. yeah, dude, the whole thing has a digital dash on the inside. If you look at yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, no, like, I remember uh, that. You know, yeah, I've, I've seen like the the, the the like the like like the retro little like montages and like like yeah. lo-fi like card, edits or whatever. Yeah. This was the first card it would talk to you if you left the door open when you drove away. Also, uh, if I like or, or do anything else. It well, how much does this cost? Nineteen eighty-four. I mean, nice one, twenty k. Shitty one, ten k. Sure. And what are we betting on? I don't give a fuck. What's a good thing to bet on? I don't know. What do you think? I don't think you're gonna get Dan Clancy banned or like in, in, move that in this position. It's about how much of the Shapiro. Like the problem is, I have to align myself with people I don't really like. So what's like what's, 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 the, what's the timeline from from a step down three months? Yeah, I don't know. I have to let me think about this. Um, if you go to the timeline. I don't give a fuck buying your car, right? But if you mm -hmm. lose, instead of, well, instead, of instead of wearing your cowboy hat, I want you to wear like like little cat ears, like pink yeah. ones, like really cute ones. Do you know who you're talking to? Done. Okay. You, but it has done. to be. It has to be right, lock it in, in. Lock it in. I oh, no, wear the uh, biggest pink cat ears. Hold on. Hold I on. Wear a full Wait, set cat the terms suit. right. Set the terms right. It has to be okay. in in every media appearance, big or small, right? Whether you're on Destiny's podcast. Or you're gonna go on CNN or some shit like that on the news. You have to be wearing it. Done. Agreed. Uh, for five years. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Five years. No way. I'm I'm the CEO of a company, Redact.dev, by the way, that lets you like mass delete your Discord messages, mass delete your Twitter and Reddit messages, mm. all that shit. It's a huge company. We're growing rapidly. It's like the only software that lets you go. Well, it's growing rapidly now. You're hashtag adding onto my stream. Yeah, for... yeah, yeah. Fuck. I thought you weren't going to catch on to it. Anyways, I was going to say I do a lot of media appearances. I will absolutely wear cat ears if I lose. I will wear the full cat outfit. Um, I don't give a shit. But I'm not going to lose though. Just so you know. Three I months for Dennis to step down. <sighs> Three months. I'm trying to think how much pressure. That, that is. Guy. That is. That's not happening. Let me think. Six months. Because the problem is he might he might do one of the sneaky shits. Like you remember what Emmett did, where he was kind I know, of like, I know, I know. Out, what, you know what I mean? So what you're saying is that he, there's a way that he's gonna he's gonna slide himself out of it. Or like, or destiny unbanned. Twitch. Wait, hold on. Twitch. There's another way. There's another way. Wait, this is not fair. Either he leaves, or I get what I want, which is destiny unbanned. That, okay, okay, that's not happening. That's not happening. Okay, I'll, I'll put money on that. Sure, whatever. Okay, D done. Sure. Done. Um, Six are ah. you still coming? Are you still coming to our election night stream? Uh, when is that? On November fifth. I gotta check up. I gotta check with Hassan. Uh, when is his? That's really fucking funny that you did that. You said that. <laughs> We're gonna. We'll have train wrecks there virtually. <sighs> okay. You remember uh, last the last one? Was bro, bad. bro, bro. Okay, listen, listen. Right now the odds. What? The odds for Trump are massive, bro. I mean, that's I'm, why I'm trying. I'm trying to get my limits upgraded uh, on stake so I could put a fat fucking like multi-million. I, I said ten mil, but uh, I don't think it'll let me do ten mil. Uh, get the fuck out for of here, for for Kamala, because brother, it's been out sixty-three percent. Uh, for what Trump winning or for Kamala? for Trump winning? Um, the, um, oh, yeah, the... I don't, I don't, I don't think there's any chance Trump wins. The thing is, here's the thing. See, that's what I'm saying. You know what it is? X. It's like DGG. It's like it, exactly what you said. It, it's like holy shit! This huge force of fucking retards, they are everywhere. But then you realize it's just like three thousand autistic people. That's like Trump's. Oh, base. it's it's a lot more than that, that brother. That market. No, I is understand. It's more than that. Massive. But, but it's like, almost a billion insane. dollars. They're all insane, though, right? They all like who the fuck goes to rallies? Like, what a weird thing. To it's do. mostly young men, and young men now are very um, red pilled and very much into like crypto and shit like that. So what, yes, what do you think, these markets think are have... inflated. In yeah, favor of Trump, actual, yes. What do you think the actual odds are? You know that you know. Also, the funniest fucking part. The the, um, uh, the odds in that Evan. Yeah, the actual odds. What do you think? Sixty-five. Of what? Kamala winning? Yeah. Yeah, I, th I think it's probably very likely around that point as well. I um, you know, the funny part is all like the super crypto guys, right? That are like all hard on Trump. You guys are kind of fucking stupid because Trump will like turn on a dime and ban crypto the second that something bad happens with crypto. 
Like the second some terrorist uses crypto or some kid gets fucking. Oh, abducted, let me guess. Let me guess. He's gonna ban it and put it into a bill that's not gonna pass in fucking sixty years. Got you it. You know who? The, hey, let me tell you something. You know the only person to pass anti-gun legislation in the last twenty years? Trump. Okay. So you know so why we're, he did it? So we're saying is that the threat is gonna be in the next election. That's when things will actually be at play. So we have another. Every time that there's a threat of something that, that can be ripped away from my hands, right? I put a four-year buffer on it at least, right? Because they'll use that as leverage for their next for the next whatever. I know he can't run again, right? But it'll be in the next person. There's always there's always gonna be a four-year buffer on big changes. That's what it is. I know it's because why yeah. why do you think that's useful when you're president? I just, when you, is, you can do Trump something. Is, Trump, to, Trump, Trump is like the worst person in the world to get behind because the second that whatever reason you like him. The second it's not popular or he has a better option, he'll just fucking dump you like immediately. Like if he's all in on, on crypto right now, if there's another opportunity that comes ahead and it's like, hey, Trump, how would you like to have like all in on the US dollar and then you'll make more money? He'll fucking ban that shit instantly. He doesn't give a fuck. He's not loyal to anyone like only for himself. That's it. Like a lot of honestly, if you're into crypto, Kamala is better because she wants stability and probably because she's beholden um, to all of the DNC. You know what? And there's probably a fuck ton of DNC people that have money in crypto. Like, you know, it's probably true. There's probably a fuck ton of DNC people that are like, hey, don't fuck with my crypto. I donated to your campaign. Don't do it. And Kamala probably has to fucking do it. Trump is insane. He literally will not give a fuck. As I said, the only dude, the only president that we've been under that's had gun legislation has been Trump because he pussied out and signed it. Because of all, all the negative attention instantly. So, I mean, imagine, like, terrorists using Bitcoin to buy anthrax. That's it. That's yeah. the end of Coinbase. And, and, then, Coinbase and, then, and then and then, yeah. and then, and then Aiden also panicking, and he's going to fucking send a text to fucking Baron uh, uh, Trump, right? And then that shit will never pass. So, I'm good on it. It's whatever. I don't give a fuck. I think that that shit's that's so unlikely. I mean, I will agree with you that Trump is really fucking dog shit at passing legislation. Yeah. He did pass the bump stock ban, though. It's fucking crazy, dude. Can you can we be real for a second? Um, Trump, Trump made his own fucking coin, and people are buying it. Can you believe that shit? Um, yes, people people <laughs> make their own coins all the time, and everybody buys it. Is what it is. It's not. And people think like so. All the shit that Trump has sold, like the sneakers and the watches and all that other shit, you know that money just goes to Trump, not to his campaign. Oh, wait. the the money for what? Like all the shit that Trump is selling on fucking Twitter, the the sneakers, the watch, the crypto, the limited edition trading cards, all of that just goes to him. It's not to his campaign. You're not donating to his campaign. Uh, okay. I, I just want to meet the people that buy the Trump trading cards. Yeah, yeah, but he invests in his own in his own campaign like often, right? Because I think that there's caps on campaign donations, and then that's like the loophole. Is that how that works? I have no fucking idea how much money Trump is putting into his own shit, but whatever it is, it's probably definitively so he doesn't go to jail. If he doesn't get, if he yeah, doesn't win, there's caps he, on it. If he doesn't win, there's a lot of people that are fucked. Uh, there's a lot of people that have tied their entire future to Trump. Like for instance, I think Elon, to a certain extent, probably has tied his future to Trump. Um, Boy, which is so, weird. So, so then we're done? Elon Musk has tied his future to Trump. Um, yeah, I, I, it is under my understanding that right now Elon, Elon is just saying a, sh a lot of shit he doesn't even agree with it um, and would never agree with it just because it's, it's his better plan right now. That's Isn't just... it, you know, have you ever thought about how weird it is that Elon went full righty? Because think about the people that were like buying electric cars. They're all lefties, right? They're all like Hassan's types and shit like that. And now all of them fucking hate Elon. It's so weird. Um... Um, I, I, you know, I think, you know, I think, I think that that's just kind of like the course of life and it comes into like right and left. I feel like, um, some, somebody will have an, a, a life event happen to them. And then usually the right has like some form of like a red pill answer for them. And then they're like radicalized. I think that's just kind of how it is. You think it was the trans kids thing for him that fucking drove him up, drove him over the edge? Uh, Yes. Like that was the defining moment. Yes, and he, he probably has some this thing inside of his head that like, oh, people hate me anyway, so might as well do this or whatever. So I'm like the super villain or whatever, right? And then I'm I'm gonna go. I just lost a lot of money on this Twitter shit, 
and I'm, I'm down on this and on that. I'm gonna fucking ball out on taxes and shit like that and fucking go full Trump and haha, ha, they played into my hand and my plan. Now I'm paying less on taxes, I rule the world. That's, I think that's the current fucking state. That's it that. is so strange. I mean, I know he has a fuck ton of money, but like that's... if you have $50 billion, dude, you could, you can become an unironic James Bond villain. You can buy like your own volcano, hollow it out, have a staff I, of 500 people yes, in like I think he has that. lasers. I think he has like this like, uh, um, delusion of grandeur uh thing whatever right we're like stuck on this fucking like mindset where oh yeah you know what fuck it like i might as well be the one to do something like crazy whatever the fucking is. i think he's at the situation right now like a super villain i think arc, I, think, like... I think he's so here's here's my prediction and you can tell me i'm retarded that's fine i think that if trump doesn't win he'll be indicted for campaign violation and why i say this is because um i think that elon has given him so much free advertising on Twitter, like by promoting his shit indirectly, that I think Twitter will be subpoenaed to say like, hey, you've been promoting Trump's shit like very aggressively and that has a dollar value, right? Like if you want to promote your shit on Twitter, it costs money, right? If you want to advertise something, it costs money. You can't just go and advertise, like I can't, for instance- Let, can't Let's be go. honest, this is, like a, this is one, of the, one of those things that has like, like 90,000 ways of, of defense in terms of plausible deniability and shit like that and how it plays out in court, right? That shit never goes through, and when it does, it's like in fucking 16,000 years. Like, it, it, no, it is. In, you're right, it is in 16,000 years. But I do think he's probably fucked, though, if Trump doesn't win. Um, he's betting it all. You know another guy betting it all? Is that fat fuck, Kim.com. You know that guy? Um, yeah, he, he, he gifted a bunch of stuff to my stream a bunch of times, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like a mega upload dick sucker guy. He's like, um, he's another one of these reply guys. Whenever Trump says something, there's like three people, like him, David Sachs, and someone else. They're like, oh, yeah, ex excellent tweet, sir. Well, May I have a little piece of your penis, please? Uh, uh, but anyways, see, it's, it's, that's not even my problem with these people. That's not even my problem. My problem is that the some of these guys they they don't um, which, which I think is really sad. They don't even believe in what they say anymore, right? They're yeah, they're just. just yeah. Because they have no other choice than to agree with most of the narratives that are coming out, right? Because it's the it's the uh, it's the end goal that matters more uh, than those small little maneuvers for the for the time being, right? So they're just agreeing with like things that they don't agree with. It. Gen gen I genuinely feel that way, right? You know, it's because no, that's, I, that's I, how publics are. You, you, you have to like like legitimately you all out, right? In order to get you, get you moving. Because let's be honest, do you want a Hassan on your side? that's gonna glaze your good policies and you do a lot of pushback and whatever, right? Because it, a lot of it will be lost in translation and people will probably, it, it will probably feel like you're almost like against that party, right? What you want is full on glazers. Full on glazers go nuts. You want, that, that is what they want. They want full on glazers. And Elon is full on glazing. He has no other choice. Um, yeah, I would, I would agree with that. It's sad, there's some really fucking smart people um, I, I said this example before. There's like probably the smartest dude I ever met. This guy named Naval Ravikant, um, who was is an Indian guy, and he's very rich. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know that guy. Yeah, the the the, the, the Rekful guy. Rekful, Rekful really liked that Twitter page, right? Naval, I follow him on Twitter. Um, he posts maybe, wis sure. he posts wisdom and self help shit. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, anyway, he's super smart dude. Super founder friendly. Um, when I knew him, like 2009, 2010. Um, he invested in one of my companies, like a really genuinely good guy that cared about helping founders in a time when everyone was fucking founders also, right? Like everyone was fucking founders. Like you would raise money from a VC and they would all put in a sneaky provision that like they have, they get 10 times their money out before you get a penny yeah, yeah, shit like that. Yeah. And he stopped all that. And the saddest fucking thing is something happened. And I think it's just like, they hate the fact that like left fucking libtards are so fucking woke now or whatever, like all these like fucking leftists are like so insane. It just pushed him to be like, oh yeah, I like Trump now. And it's like, bro, why? What? Like, I don't understand. Like, I understand like the plumber. Can, can, can I ask though? Can I ask though? Yeah, go ahead. What? The, okay, what? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna ask you a question, right? Sure. And it's, it's gonna be really, don't, don't think it's exactly what it means. Not some, some dog was whatever, right? Sure. Okay. Why is that so bad? To, to be really wealthy and to like Trump? Just that, whatever you said, right? Whatever you said before, yeah, yeah. right? Why is it bad? Why is that bad? I think, I think, I think it Wait, well, no, why is that so bad? Okay. Well, there's a lot of reasons. One, because Trump is an absolute fucking retard. 
probably okay. the dumbest motherfucker most of, of us all are. time. Most of us are. Most no. people in politics are. No. I, any person in your chat, I promise you, I will elect over president over Trump. I don't care. Even okay. if people call name, me a name, Zionist name, dog, name reasons, not umbrellas. Anyone. That's not, Red that's Man not... TV, Sky okay, okay. Ives, Adawa, That's not, that's not, them. that all is them. not a reason. Give me a reason. All time. He is so stupid and he is so bad at his job that literally everyone that worked with him quit or got fired. He doesn't even have his same VP anymore. Bro is fucking built differently in a way like he fucking smells like dog shit and no one will stay with him anymore. I don't even fucking like Kamala. I wish there was, you know what? I'm going to tell you, I'm going to give you something hot take. If fucking George Bush was running or Bill Clinton or fucking Obama or any of them, that's just someone you can be proud of to be a fucking president, someone presidential, not some fucking retard who's telling dick jokes on Twitter. I would elect them a thousand fucking times over any of these dipshits. Any of them. But for one, Trump is fucking stupid. He is stupid and he rambles. He makes no sense. When you listen to his uh, I mean, speech, I've, I've, I've seen, I've seen real life. Yeah, the guy's a, he's a yapper. It doesn't stop. He has no policies either, right? He's just a puppet controlled by whoever the fuck is behind him, which is J.D. Vance, I guess, a Jewish guy, right? So I, I don't know what to say. He has nothing behind him except keeping himself out of jail. He has no policies. He has no nothing. It's not derangement, Sid. Hold on. Clave, it's not Durant. You get, you think Trump is smart? He's a fucking... I promise you, Clave, I will vote for you Ten seconds over remaining. Trump to be president. Okay, XQC chatter, I believe in you. All of you inside Five of XQC chat, remaining. all of you guys, I guarantee you, are smarter than Trump. Guaranteed. Okay? And I will vote for you. I will. I will write your name in. You, chatter. I will write your name in. Um. So, okay, so there... The first part is that he's like lost his mind. The second part is, um, I guess I'm a little bit scared if he gets voted in that it's gonna be like a civil war in America. Like it, he, people hate him so fucking much. Um, the problem is it's gonna cause instability. Yeah, so that, that's, that, that sounds like fear mongering, I'm gonna be able to do it. It's like, like appeal, to, I mean, appeal to fear very much, but yeah, go ahead. It is appealing to fear. Like, he's the type of guy who's like, oh, I'm going to pull us out of NATO. Like, that's a big fucking deal, dude. Do you know what that means to, like, I feel, I feel like America a lot of that he NATO? says, right, is, isn't even doable, like, in, in well, the I, real I, world, I, let's be honest. Do we want a president that, that says... No, no, but I'm, 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 but I'm, 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 so that, I'm just so saying... So that's why I don't like him, then. Like, the excuse you give for him is, like, oh, he can't well, it's do not, that. Well, it's not really an excuse, though. I'm just, I'm just, I was just saying, like, um, it's... Okay, it's... so I'm, 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 I'm telling you, like, these are the things Trump said and how he's retarded. And you're like, oh, well, he can't probably do that. <laughs> I'm like, the, he thinks he can. He thinks he can drop a nuke to change the weather. Like, I don't I don't know what to say. The Republicans are fucking crazy. They think the Jews are controlling the weather. Like, unironically. Like, a, a good portion of them. Probably of your chat, maybe 20%. Ones in chat if you think Jews can control the weather. Real quick, ones in chat. Well, I mean, the, one's everything say one. Two's I, if they I, I, I'm the type one. Yeah, see? Now, let me tell you. Why do you want to be on the side of the party that can't control the weather? You guys are fucking losers. Yeah, that's right. Loser L Republican Trump can't control the weather. Bitch made fucking party. Not, imagine not even being able to control fucking hurricanes. You guys are fucking dog shit. We've been doing that shit the for years. The problem is, okay, like, it's within my understanding of politics, right? That if you're not saying some bold shit, right? Some things that are like very flat out and simple, right? Like like Trump does it, you have to be perfect, right? And unfortunately for the people on the left, right? Is that they aren't perfect and they get clapped. That's just, that's just what it is. Trump says some really, really like, like just very entry level statements that are very short, right? And you can say with, with, with pride, these guys, they love me. These guys will pay for this wall. These guys are gonna do that, right? And all the brain deads go, yeah, yeah. It's easy to digest. It sounds good. It's it's said with fucking eloquence, and they and it sticks, right? If the left had somebody that's actually smart and knows to play that game publicly in their speech, they would clap like it's no tomorrow. But instead, know, the they play this. So like, I'm perfect. Stupid. I'm. Why I'm do they do this? I'm so Why, progressive I, and I cool. Know. I love everybody. Everybody wins, disagree. and they get clapped because you aren't perfect. That's the real you know, problem, bro. I'm telling you right now. Obama was had to be almost perfect. That's true. Kanye said that. He had to. 
listen, if the Democrats every year just elected a white 45 year old dude, they would never lose again. Like a Bill Clinton yeah, every year. Yeah, they would exactly. Never, they would never lose again. They would never lose again. That would, that would literally be the end of the Republican Party if they did that one thing. I shit you not. It's, it's fucked up, not, but it's he's true. Not, he's, not even, he's not even wrong. I am uh, not wrong. A, a straight, white, male dude that says bullshit and is also smart and knows how to play a political game. On the left, it would be a free slam dunk across the board. It'd be like 95 to 5. destroy. There would be nothing left. There would be nothing left. Like, I don't... What would probably have to happen is the Democrats would be, become so fucking dominant, the party would probably split in half. And then there would be three parties. There would be, like... Yeah. Yeah, that would probably but be what happened people if, if will, they started doing it's that. It's crazy that even to this day, even after what well, people still doesn't don't compute the fact, right? That because of how racist people still are in general, right? That Obama started like 15, 20 points down just because he's black. Like the fact yep. the fact that people don't, just don't, don't compute that is fucking ridiculous. You're insane. You're, you're like you don't even live in the real world. Like holy fuck. It's fucking crazy. It's actually insane. I don't I don't know. Uh, politics are so, they're mental right now. It would be, I would imagine it would be very strange to be like Canada or Mexico watching the U.S. elections. And they're like, uh, so are we still going to be friends in a few in a few months? Are we going to be chill? You We're loving Canada? Should, loving? Like, like, like if, if I'm saying if you're like Mexico or if you're fucking Canada and you're like, uh, are we still going to be chill in a few months? Like, because Trump is fucking crazy. Right? You Man. don't know what the fuck he's going to do. He might be like, you know what? We're just going to take Canada and they're going to give it to us and they're going to pay it. Honestly, we could probably take Canada. Like, I know we would take a lot of fallout for it. You guys, I don't think, have much of a... I mean, Canada, Canada might fall. Quebec, like, Quebec will never fall, let's be honest. Quebec's well, been... you, got, we, you guys would be... We would let you keep Quebec. You would have Quebec and then Prince Edward Island. And that's it. And we would take the rest of it. Like, all the mm. oil, all the land and shit. Like, who would stop us? Unironically. People would be like, ah, those... The world... Nah, they seconds. wouldn't. Look Remain. at what's happening in Russia and Ukraine. No one gives a shit. Yeah, but they're not NATO, are they? Five yeah, they're not NATO, remaining. but like in the same part though, it's gonna be... By the way, have you ever thought about how weird it would be um, to fight against someone that's like speaking the same same language as you? I, I, I know it sounds... Like, think about it for a second, right? People in Russia and Ukraine are fighting against each other and they're kind of speaking the same language. And it's weird, right? Because you're on the battlefield and it's not like... I think American troops are used to like, oh, I'm shooting brown people or whatever, right? Imagine that, like, you go to war with Canadians. That would be fucking weird as fuck, right? Because you're gonna be like, I'm gonna fuck you up, and then you're gonna have like XQC on the other side, like, hey, fuck off, pisser, or whatever the fuck you said. It would be fucking crazy. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. It would be like, like the Germans and the down. Battle of Stalingrad, motherfucker. They, 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 they would push and they would forget that winter is a thing, and they would fucking die frozen in place in the fucking winter of Canada. I don't give a fuck. United States are not ready to fight North. I don't give a fuck. They would fucking, they would fucking die, bitch. Are you kidding me? We'll set up embargoes, and you guys will have to like. You'll be out there with your fucking Pick goose your and your bow people. and arrows, and we'll come in and fucking steamroll you with the fucking Bradley APCs and the fucking Sherman oh, tanks. Or what the fuck? Uh, you got the Sherman tanks that are a little bit old. You guys can get it's fucking so rolled. I don't. Do you guys even have a military, or is it literally just for? Our land, land is undesirable when it comes down to the fucking weather and shit. It's undesirable, bro. You guys don't even want this fucking shit. Though. You know what? You know what's fucked up? No, it's unfair because you guys get to have like free healthcare and shit because you don't have to spend fuck all on the military you're just he like oh yo our big brother fucking true terrible. true that's so fucked up true so we we, we freeload that shit so hard it's unbelievable oh bro we man. have like two functioning jets and let's be honest if they were to take out they'd fucking fall into pieces and know the air <laughs> yeah you have, you have two jets and like one of them right now is in repair <laughs> oh fuck me bro oh canada man what the fuck Alright, well, Prepare good luck with your yeah. crusade anyway, man. Yeah, I'll see you on November 5th. Put it in your calendar. Yep, I'll be there. Wait, is, is it that early? Elections are that no early? November 5th, like, The world on... changes in... No, it's gonna be November 5th, like, plan on, like, 5 p.m. to 5 a.m. Wow. I mean, you don't have to be there the whole time. Brother, I'm telling you, if I put 10 mil on Kamashi wins, I make 14 mil off the rip. Then do it. And come. November Bro, 5th, 14 5 mil in a day is fucking insane for a fucking sports bet like that.
Come. I don't know why the crypto markets are so. You piece Can't of you shit. Stop hey, yo, you now. fucking bitch! Stop fucking talking to me, motherfucker! I'm not your puppets, you fucking loser! Get out of my fucking dick! <laughs> fucking bitch, you're 2K rated! Disconnect it! Disconnect it! Disconnect it! Disconnect! 30 seconds. <laughs> okay. Calm down, man. Calm down. Nah, man, this guy's a fucking bitch. I don't give a shit. Funny, man. Do they, do they have cooldowns in this game? Yeah. It's like League, yeah. but for, for Fox and Marvel. I'm just joking, bro. That's what I like about Rust, personally. Rust is like the last game that you can go full unhinged and nobody fucking cares. Yeah, like You uh, have people bro. that are, yeah, it's the best. Bro, every day I play Russian servers. That, uh, off stream and I, it's bro, it's like mental suicide playing on these servers, man. I like it. I think it's like the last. It's the last elements of, um, like the early days of COD. That's the last game that's like that. When it, when that game's gone, I don't know what else is like it. Honestly, everything else is like policing your voice chat and shit. Man. So. Yeah, I'm true. Anyways, I got to get back to my website, danclancysucks.com, and promoting that. Um, okay. Alright, man. Well, good luck with with your thing, man. Yep. I'm, I'm telling right. you, I'm, I'm telling you, don't be grammaticalized if, she, if shit doesn't pan out, because I'm telling you, uh, I've been there. We're built differently, X. Well, yeah, that's later. the problem. Yeah, it is the problem. You give up. I this, this, give might, up. this might be your last battle. I'm scared for you, man. No, you need to be scared for yourself. I'll teach you how to do it, alright? Alright, man. Well, you take care, man. Yeah, later. Bye. See ya. Well begun.